can go find somebody else. I can go see somebody else. I can do this. I can do that. And it's just like, it's just more so opportunities. You know what I'm saying? People may see that you have a lot more opportunities than the next person. You know what I'm saying? And just from somebody knowing that, they're going to have an attitude with you. All right, guys, I'm back with another video. Uh, I'm going to do a body game video. And this was like a comment. I've been getting comments on this. And <laughs> I actually have experienced this. So I was like, I got to make a video on this. And it's just like, you know, I definitely want to tell you all like my experience or like things you may experience while you're on body game. But pretty much the question is like, or somebody was basically saying like attitudes on body game, like women having attitudes on body game, like <laughs> understand that. I didn't think that's a good thing about having a community or that's a good thing making about making videos because that is something that does happen. And I've seen it happen and everything like that. But yeah, let's get into it. So I guess like, why would a woman have attitude on body game, like attitude with you? So one of the things too, I feel like people who are either they do like looks, money, status or whatever like that, whatever. Uh, the more successful you are on that spectrum or the more successful you are on that skill is, is that you will deal with people who will have like more attitudes to, towards you or more animosity. But one of the things that I like, I know it is, or one of the main things is just that they don't like the options that you have. Like I've noticed this like with dating or like, I notice it's like with people in general, even with friends, it could be a woman who's your friend or like you're dating. If you have a lot of opportunities or you have a lot of options, women will get jealous or feel a type way about you being able to do certain things, man. Like I, it's almost it's like, I, I want you to go, but I don't want you to go. You know what I'm saying? I don't want you out of the side of my life because one of the things like dealing with Atlanta or whatever like that is not a lot of women. I mean, it's not a lot of men for the dating in Atlanta. Like, like I'm going to tell y'all like straight up, it's like the ratio to men to women is crazy. Like it's a lot more women in Atlanta. Like if you go to the clubs or whatever like that, it's women everywhere. Like it's women here, it's women in the workplace. And I think that when you're in an environment or you're in a top city where there's not a lot of men, it's just like, I noticed like the standards are just so low, bro. So when the standards are so low, if somebody, if you are a good person or, you know what I'm saying, you are in the dating world and you're able to, you know, have just di different things going on for yourself, like a car or whatever like that, or you just say like, you're around a lot of people, women will be mad. Like if you move on, like if you just cut somebody off, like or you know what i'm saying if you're dealing with a woman you're dating whatever like that and you just cut them off a lot of times they'll have attitudes or a lot of times like you know what i'm saying women do not want you to necessarily leave because man it's crazy out here it's also for men too but when it's just not a lot of men out there you will notice women will have attitudes for you so it's just like whether if it'll be like damn if you do damn if you don't but like if how, how do i explain it like it's pretty much saying that you have a lot of opportunities for other women or you have a lot of chances for other women. And sometimes when you're our practicing body game, as I said before, not that many people are in shape. Not a lot of people are really, really good shape. And then especially too, like, I guess for if you are older, a lot of the older men are not in shape, bro. So it's just like when you do something wrong or, you know, when it feels like you may leave a lot easier, you know what I'm saying? It just makes them feel like maybe, you know, they didn't do something right. Or maybe like, you know what I'm saying? It would be harder to go back out into the streets, you know what I'm saying? To like dating, bro. It's, it's really hard out here, bro. And it's just like, even with social media, it's like even for men and women, we're able to see so many different types of people at all times. So somebody will feel, especially if they're a younger age, they'll feel like I don't have to deal with this by like I can go find somebody else. I can go see somebody else. I can do this. I can do that. And it's just like it's just more so opportunities. You know, so people may see that you have a lot more opportunities than the next person. You know what I'm saying? And just from somebody knowing that they're going to have an attitude with you. Like they, if they feel as though like you can just dip and you're good. Oh yeah. Anybody would feel a way. It's not just even women. It's just like anybody would feel a type of way. So another thing too, like with attitudes with women, sometimes it's like, from what I experienced, it's like from my experience, I think that, um, when somebody or like quote unquote, if other women find you the top dog, bro, 
<laughs> like mind you, you don't you don't do this hierarchy. Like the power that women have, I know for sure is like they get to choose who's attractive, who has the most stat. Like they choose that. You know what I'm saying? The attention that they give somebody. But when you're a top dog, you know what I'm saying, or it's not only just one girl like liking you or attracted to you, you become more attractive, and that is very very angering because then it's just like you have a lot of options you have a lot of power you have a lot of women but at the same time it's like it's a love hate relationship with that because it's like yes i know these women want the the highest and best but they also don't like what comes with that because if you have a lot of women like going after you or chasing you because of your body or whatever like that you know they know they may have to get in the field and fight you know what I'm saying? they may have to fight or whatever like that or it might be really really crazy because you are like a hot commodity so it's just like if this one may not find you attractive or whatever, this woman may be perfect for you, you know what I'm saying? Or five other women may feel like a strong desire for you, whatever, whatever like that. And it's like women will have a, they'll feel a type of way because it's just like they feel as though it's a high competition. But at the same time, I feel like they like that. I feel like anybody would like that. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? If your girl is just high, highly sought after, it's just like when you do get her or like y'all do get in a relationship or whatever like that, it's kind of like, yo. You know what I'm saying it's mine but that is that is another thing and then too i've noticed like for different jobs or just being around different people if you do not give if a woman is like i want to say just throwing herself at you but it's like if she's showing you attention and you're not responding to the same type of attention or you're not doing you're not reciprocating bro that pisses women off bro because it's like i think anybody is really scared of rejection but for like women it's just that much bigger of a deal because i feel like now the dynamics are changing like a lot of men are not approaching women first so two have women have to put themselves out there and then so if they're putting themselves out there with you and then you tell her no that's gonna cause a big attitude you know what I'm saying? that's gonna be like that's gonna be that's gonna be uncomfortable you feel me like and that goes for like men and women but I just think that, like, for, for women specifically, bro, they do not like when you just, <laughs> when you just, you know what I'm saying, you use your options or you, you know what I'm saying, you have different time and different women and stuff like that. So it's just like, you have to understand great power and come, great, come, well, great power comes great responsibility. So you have to be understanding of like, hey, you know, if you are working on yourself, you become that much more attractive you know what i'm saying or you know you're saying working yourself you got a nice job you're high status you know what i'm saying all this and you make a lot of money guess what that's like attractiveness and stability they gonna be on you my guy like they gonna be on you bro but it's just like i think like there's also too like don't take attitudes as a as a bad thing you know what i'm saying i want you guys to understand this so like if a woman's having an attitude with you you have to understand that's still time you know what I'm saying she's still like spending time thinking about you you know what i'm saying it's almost as like if somebody hates you so much or you know what I'm saying for youtubers or celebrities or like that if somebody hates somebody so much that is still attention that's still time and that's still valuable attention on social media or um on um or celebrity sites because like if somebody spends so much time you know oh okay boom i don't like this i don't like this i don't like this they're still spending time of like you're running through their mind you know what i mean so it's just like a lot of times people forget like how valuable time is so if you're spending time hating the person that's gonna make the person bigger because a person now is going to question okay why is this person why do they hate you so much so then y'all gonna have a whole conversation about that y'all might even become friends based off of hating somebody and that's how like social media works a lot but uh but for women just don't see it as that like don't be too like in your feelings about it if a woman does have an attitude with you I'd say that's a good thing because it's showing that she cares. Because if she didn't care, like women, if they don't like something, they're not going to deal with it. Like, I'm just telling you, you know what I'm saying? They make they can say everything, but it's like, if they're not feeling you, bro, they're not going to have an attitude with you. You know what I'm saying? If they not feeling it, like, you know what I'm saying? They, they, you won't have that much of an interaction. But if somebody's like constantly hating you, whatever like that, they may like you. You know what I'm saying? Some. Some women can't really come off direct because they're scared of rejection. But at the same time, it's like if somebody's having an attitude with you, kind of look further into it. You know what I'm saying? Be in your masculine frame and figure it out. Whether it's seeing it as a problem, like really trying to investigate it. You know what I mean? But I think, yeah, sometimes women will have attitudes. But yeah, don't look into it as being a problem every moment. 
It's just that you gotta look further into it. You know what I mean? It's not bad, but you know what I'm saying? When you do work on yourself, you do become more powerful. You do become better. You know what I'm saying? The best version of yourself. Especially when somebody can see you working on yourself, you're getting better. They're gonna be like, you know what? That guy's not so bad after all. You know what I'm saying? Well, maybe I do like this guy or whatever. So just can kind of think of it that way, but I do understand women will have attitudes with you. But not all the time is bad. Just kind of think of it that way. But yeah, that's the end of the video. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you guys in my next video. I'm out.